Um, welcome back to another part of the Sims 4 City Living Let's Play. I am so sorry that it has been like 3,000 years since I've last uploaded. Um, but I'm really happy to be able to jump back into this. Uh, right now Gina is just waking up. She really needs to take a shower and she's still very tired. But um, other than that, she's doing okay. She's doing okay. We're going to have her take a thoughtful shower. Uh, really? Oh. I think it's because she was singing. <laughs> oh, really? Because the other night you told us that we don't have a life. Oh, I guess they're still not over the, the fancy toilet. And to be quite honest, I'm not either. Like, if I had one of those, I would always be impressed by it. Uh, but anyways, <laughs> I am happy to announce that my semester is finally over. So uh, for the next, I think, month or so, I should be able to do uploads... I'm going to shoot for every other day. Um, I'm going to try my best to maintain that. So, uh, yeah, look forward to that. And there is a mouse in this apartment, and it's really disgusting. That's the other thing, is that I'm getting real tired of this place, to be quite honest, because we're always dealing with these disgusting vermin. There's, like, roaches that appear over here, mice over here, this thing breaks, that thing breaks. It's just like, no. So... Again, I'm going to try to have them focus on their careers in this part, probably try to get more money so that they can move on. I want to move them out. Um, Alright, well, yeah, this gives us another reason to want to move out. <laughs> she just says that we are inconsiderate neighbors and she will not forget that. So, whatever. Honestly, don't care. Um... <laughs> We already got her husband killed, so I'm sure she hasn't forgotten that either. Alright, go ahead and take care of the mouse, because it's disgusting. And I'm done dealing with them all the time. And now she's dirty again! You know what? Just just go back to bed. Just, just go back to bed. I should have had Salim do it. I forgot that it lowers your hygiene. Dramatically, it's been a while since I've played City Living, alright? Um, uh, why won't you go back to bed? Okay, thank you. Gosh, it's just, it's already rough in this part. <laughs> but, okay, so what I want to do is move them into an apartment with more than one bedroom, probably. Please stop, Victor, please. No. Okay, we are taken. Can't, everybody's trying to, like, break these two up, I swear. It's, like, what do these two ever do to you, honestly? Stop. <laughs> Leave them be. Okay, Salim, go ahead, take a shower. Okay, he's gonna go ahead and sing in the shower. How about that? And, um, please, please. I was kind of thinking about moving Anita in with us because, as you can see, she is extremely clingy. <laughs> the, the only thing happening in our place is Salim is in the shower, and maybe that's why she wants to come in, okay? I don't really know. She's been getting a little bit flirty with him, I think, and I'm kind of like, Ugh. Um, but, okay, the flea market is in town, and I would like to go today. Um, we don't really have a lot of money to be spending, but I would still like to go. So, uh, we will do that soon. Not right now, because these two really need to, like, get, get themselves together here. But, yeah, Gina, Gina doesn't seem to be able to, or not Gina, Anita doesn't seem to be able to leave us alone. And I'm kind of like, you know what, I might as well just move her back in with her sister, because... Well, she won't admit that she she can't be um, independent. She just doesn't... I don't know. I just feel like she needs... <laughs> she needs her sister, honestly. She she really does. And there's something weird going on with Salim and her, too. But I'm not gonna... I, maybe we should try to spice up the drama a little bit. I don't know. Is that wrong? It could be... She, it's been like two minutes! Okay. Okay, let your sister in. Just let her in. She can come to the flea market with us, I guess. I mean, gosh, she won't leave us alone. This is what I'm talking about. It's like she just doesn't quit. She doesn't quit. She doesn't... She, she'll keep going. Um, it's kind of funny. I gotta admire her um, persistence, honestly. So... <laughs> okay. 
Hurry up and shower so we can head over to the flea market. You should be able to get some fun there. Um, Alright, she just comes in and watches our TV. I think we have a nicer TV than the one that she has, so that might be why. Maybe she's just using us. I don't really know. But... I kind of want to keep her around too because I would like to get her a job and like earn some extra money. Um, so that we can move on even more in the future, you know? Like I want to just keep moving up in the in the apartment realm. Just keep upgrading, 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 you know, until eventually we get to our own private penthouse. Wouldn't that be awesome? That would be pretty cool. Um, Alright, hurry up, girl. You're taking forever. Okay, we're just going to have her take a... A sanitizing dump right right now real quick <laughs> and, and we'll head over to the festival all right hurry before it closes you guys I would like for Salim to have had some paintings ready but I just don't think that that is gonna happen let me go in here real quick um, show festival info and we will travel to the flea market and we will bring Gina and Anita, respectively, and I will see you guys. Okay, there. here we are. There's just this big mob of people who randomly spawned at the same place at the same time. Like, wow. Nice, everybody. Nice to see you all. So, this is actually. Oh my goodness. Oh, what is happening? I'm pretty sure the food stalls are not supposed to be on top of the displays. Like, okay. <laughs> no comment. <laughs> Unless these are for sale? Is that what's going on? I don't really know. I don't think so. Strange. You can... What is going on in here? Jeez. What is going on? This is so weird. Well, okay. Um, why don't we go see what's over here? So they got these cool rocks over here. Oh yeah, and as I was saying, this is like Salim and Gina's first time coming to um, the flea market. So that's pretty exciting. Um, I don't think it's supposed to look like this. I did come here with <laughs> with my sim from my other Let's Play and this is not what it looked like. So call me crazy, but um, something's going on here. I would like to buy something, but I'm not really sure if there's anything that I'm particularly interested in. This looks kind of interesting. It's like a modern a modern seat, I think. But it looks more like a bench. Like, would you put that in your house? I don't really know. I guess we can get the pillow fluff thing. That's kind of cute. Yeah, let's do that. We'll just buy that, I guess. We'll put it somewhere in the apartment. It could be fun. It, it's got the bright colors to match the living room of Celine's apartment, so, I mean, why not, right? But these are just empty. Like, they're totally just taking up all this space for no reason. Okay. And then I think, I think, what are you doing? Okay, she's watching the performance. Gina needs to use a bubble blower. So there's one right over here, and I'm going to have them just unwind together so that she can get that unlocked. Um, awesome, cool. I don't know if Anita's around. We invited her. Oh, she is. Okay, cool. Hello, Anita. Oh, she's like choking on bubbles. You know, I can't... I don't know if it's if it's safe to just blow in bubbles because it's like soap, right? Like that, that can't taste good. It really it, it can't. Um, <laughs> okay, he needs to go to the bathroom real quick. She is just not happy. She's tense, but this should be helping her. It says unwind. Doesn't look like she's really unwinding right now though. She's got some angry. <laughs> she's giving her sister the stank eye. I mean. Come on. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> there we go. Now she's dazed. Um. <laughs> it says she might have done that wrong. <laughs> okay. Uh, I think what could be kind of fun is if they come over here and do a little hoops competition. How about that? They will shoot around together maybe or she can challenge. She will challenge Salim and Anita. She's probably going to lose but it could be fun. Let's try it out. Um. Okay, let's see. Who is the best at basketball? Probably not Salim or Gina. They're just not sporty like Anita. But then again, it doesn't look like she even knows how to throw the basketball, so maybe they do stand a chance. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
Come on. <laughs> like, what is that? I don't know much about sports, okay? I don't really know much about basketball either. But I do know from, like, high school gym class that what Salim did is how you're supposed to throw the ball, I'm pretty sure. And what these two are doing is not how you're supposed to throw it. I don't think you're supposed to, like, just lift it up from in between your legs towards the basket. Like, that just doesn't seem like a good strategy. Like, look at that. What is that? <laughs> Look at me trash talking my Sims when they're playing better than I can. Just saying. Um, awkward. Okay. I want to see who wins, though. Who's winning right now? Oh, it looks like Gina is. She has made three consecutive close shots. Good job. I'm proud of her. See, that takes skill. I mean, maybe not against these two because they don't seem to be knowing what they're doing, but. <laughs> it's still fun. Okay. Let's see what else we can do. Um, there's a bar over here. Maybe we can do some karaoke later because she does need to get her singing skill up. So we will try that out. Um, I want them to finish their game though because I want to see who wins. It, it doesn't seem like Salim is winning. <laughs> he doesn't have like any mood at all. Come on. Is it over? Are you done? Oh, she won. Okay. Cool. Court royalty from winning a basketball competition. And now she needs some food, so I'm going to have her come over here real quick and grab something to eat. Let's just see. Is there anything we haven't eaten? We'll do this. Is Salim hungry? Um, yeah, he is. We'll come over here and we'll have him grab some of that. And it's really busy over here. Like, wow. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah. <laughs> I want them to go to the bar later and do some karaoke. Um, okay, well, I did one hour, so we have to hurry up here. I guess it doesn't really matter since we only bought, like, one thing, and I didn't really care for anything else. Uh, let's see if there's anything cool. They've got all these little stones. They all have different mood effects. But I just don't... That is food, Okay. <laughs> I just don't really see them using it. And the rest are toys and then a voodoo doll. And I just don't really think that Salim <laughs> or Gina need a voodoo doll. Like, who are you going to voodoo? They don't really have enemies, I don't think. They're pretty friendly people. Um, they seem to get along with, with pretty much everybody. Which is good. <laughs> Definitely a good thing. Alright, hurry up, guys. Hurry up, finish eating, and we'll check out the bar together. How about that? Okay, cool. Salim has learned more another recipe. I think Gino is about to learn one as well. I wish it would combine the like household totals, but I guess it makes sense that on an individual basis it's like if you if this individual sim has tried the food then they should be able to make it. But um whatever, we're gonna have him come over here. She's so tired, but like we're gonna get through this. We, oh we are. We're gonna come order drinks for group and we're gonna go ahead and we're all gonna have um a tang and zing. How about that? That sounds like a good time. Um, stop playing basketball. Oh, she's being mean. See, I spoke too soon. I said that they don't have- Oh, is karaoke contest night at the bar? We're definitely doing this. Oh my gosh. So they're going to come get a drink. And they're going to come sing. And of course this show off over here is probably going to win. Like, hands down. Already won the competition. First one to go. How are my sims going to compete with that? I don't really think they can. <laughs> She has a really pretty voice over here, too. It's hard to hear because there's so much sound going on at once. Come on, guys. Hurry up. Get your drinks. How many times have I said come on in this video? I feel like I just keep repeating myself. <laughs> oh, I'm just getting impatient, I guess. Alright. Let's have them sing before the karaoke competition ends. I think we have one hour. So... Singing karaoke contest. We're gonna do Shaken, Not Stirred. Sounds like an emotional song of some sort. And we're gonna kick one of these people off. I guess we can't. Dang, whatever. Let's watch Salim. Let's see how he does. Ooh, he's got the stars. He must be good. Okay. It doesn't sound bad. Okay, yeah. No, I can get behind this. Let's see his singing skill. Ooh, he's only level 3, but he's doing pretty well. I kind of like it. He's got a really, like, low, kind of like raspy voice, and it sounds kind of good, you know? I like it. 
I want to hear Gina sing, but it's, it looks like she passed out on the floor. All right. <laughs> I guess... I guess. I want her to sing. She's going to do fun tonight if she wakes up, because I think she's having a little bit too much fun tonight. Just kidding. She is not. All right, he got 55 out of 100 points. That doesn't sound like a good score, but we'll see. Oh, goodness. Oh, jeez. This girl sounds way better. Is it just like every other sim in this freaking city can sing except for mine? I mean, honestly, they all sound really good. Okay, Anaya Jang won. Who would have thought that it wouldn't be Celine or Gina? Davinelli Nami. All right. Um, I think we should really have them go home <laughs> because because they are like really tired. But wait. Um, I want to get a picture of her real quick singing karaoke. So um, hold on real quick. We'll do this because <laughs> I don't think I have any pictures of my Sims doing karaoke. You know. Let's get a good picture. Come on, open your mouth and sing. I think her eyes were closed in that one. <laughs> oh gosh, okay. <laughs> That'll work. Um, Alright, let's have them head home. That was kind of a funny picture, I think. <laughs> Alright, so... My sims are just waking up. Selim has to go to work in an hour. And Gina really needs to go to the bathroom. So I'm going to have Selim grab some food real quick. Unfortunately, I do not make him do his daily task. Oops. He's got to go really soon. Is it even worth feeding him? Probably not. He can eat at work. Have fun! <laughs> Alright, we might have to make sure that we get Gina's stuff done. She needs to write a column and she starts working two hours. So... Gosh, she really needs fun though. We're gonna have her play a game real quick and hopefully she'll have enough time to get this done. I really don't know. We are not going to be doing that right now, Anita. There's no time for exercise. We have to play video games. <laughs> okay, let's see, when does she work? Two hours. Okay, um... That should be enough fun, right? Please write your column. I really want you to get promoted. <laughs> We'll write a column about the festival, yeah? And it looks like our rent is due, which kind of stinks, but yeah, that's life. All right, she's almost done. All right, she did it. Okay, so she made it. Um, all right, so lately all of Sims, Salim's, sorry, Sims' story, oh, I cannot read, have started to sound the same. They say variety is the spice of life, so maybe he could try mixing it up a bit. Should he try branching out into a new area of expertise or just keep on doing the same thing? Why don't we try something new? You know, it never hurt. Oh. All right, he did it. He got a, a small performance gain. Good job, Salim. And she's hungry, so let's get her food real quick before she leaves. Um, Gosh, I really hope... She, I think she's close to a promotion. Yeah, she should get promoted. And, oh, she has to go to work right now. Goodbye. 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 <laughs> Goodbye. All right, I'll skip to when Salim gets back. <laughs> All right, so Salim just got back. He made 400 simoleons, and he's about to spend every single one of them on the rent. Poor Salim. All of his money goes right down the drain as soon as he gets home. <laughs> but I think we can have him paint for a little bit um, so we can make a little bit more money, but he's too tense right now, so he needs to get some fun. Why don't you come over here and play some My Sims Go? Yeah, yeah, sounds good, sounds good. I really, really, really wanted to have him sell paintings at the flea market, but like I completely forgot when it was. So, but we're gonna do that at some point. Oh, ooh, there's another festival in town today, and I think that oh, oh wait, there's so many things happening at once. Okay, so the hijinks and humor festival is tonight. I think Gina has to light some fireworks there or something for her um, lifetime wish, and then she also got a promotion to a beat reporter. So she will make some more simoleons now, and she can now recommend local hangout interaction and respond to mail interaction, um, which is cool. Now, I thought at level three, you were supposed to be able to pick the branch, but let me see. Oh, it looks like it's the next one. So she can become a snooty pundit or a chow chaser. 
So I guess at level four, you officially choose which brand, I, branch, sorry. And I think she would be the snooty pundit. So pretty soon here, we'll be able to get that done. She's going to take a thoughtful shower. Gosh, the other thing Celine needs to do is start writing books. So actually, instead of painting, I think we're going to go ahead and do that. Um, he's going to start a genre book. He will do... Hmm. Hmm. Why don't you write a screenplay? He's feeling inspired. Good. It happened one lunch break. <laughs> um. You know what? That doesn't sound like a bad title. And let's see. What can we write about it? Um. The tragedy of the greatest food fight in history. Sounds good. <laughs> it could be like Romeo and Juliet, except about a food fight. I could see that, you know? He's like the new modern era Shakespeare. Oh, oh, the, the festival's happening right now, you say? Oh, okay, finish up showering and we're gonna have Gina come out. I don't think Selim really needs to. He's already been there. And I don't think the tea thing is even gonna work. I just really want her to go down there and get the reward done. So let's see. Where is this festival at? Okay, right here. Yeah, the stupid tea things still will not work. And I've kind of given up on that. And I apologize if you wanted to see how it worked. There's really not much I can do. Okay, so where do I buy the... I think it's over here. You buy like a fire... Firework. Have her come buy some swag real quick. Okay. So, I think it just has to be like a regular. Could be probably any of these things. We're gonna do one of those. Light fireworks. Maybe, maybe not. We can try this and see if it works. Otherwise, there's like actual fireworks. I believe. This might work though. Hopefully that doesn't start on fire, cause you're you're lighting that pretty close there. Oh, oh, it doesn't really do anything impressive. Oh, I don't think that worked. I think there are some like actual fireworks, but I don't know. Good job, Salim. Don't know how to light them. Can we light those ones? Oh, you have to light three. Okay, so she got one out of three. Alright, so that's two out of three. Are there any others lying around so we don't have to waste our money? I think Salim actually has some in his inventory. He does, he does! Can I... Let's give that to Gina real quick. And we will just... She will... Uh, place in world and light. She's being real mischievous right now. She's like... Practically setting people on fire. Oh my gosh, that one was crazy. That was cool! Whoa! That one's the coolest of them all. <laughs> nice job, Gina. Good job. Did she get her... Thing. Yes, she did. Now she just needs to achieve level 3 in the singing skill, which might be a challenge because we've got a lot to work with. <laughs> or, we've got a lot to work on, I should say, based on her performance last night. Just saying. I kind of feel bad, but I mean, honestly, those vocals, they need some work. As nicely as I can possibly put it. So he is 75% done with that one book, I guess. Did you not finish it? Or did you finish it? Did he? Did I like completely ignore the thing? Oh, it's right here. Hold on, hold on. I think I didn't read something. Slim finished writing an entire book. The book will be added to his inventory for future reading enjoyment. He can also publish it. Just select the mailbox. Why don't we go ahead and do that? Um, we're gonna do this one because we deserve a publisher. Okay, we deserve a lot of royalties. <laughs> I think he's got a pretty high writing skill, so I think he's he's pretty skilled at what he does. 
Um, we're going to go ahead and write another book. We're just on a roll right now. We're going to do a motivational book. And, oh, puzzle pleasers. Nah, let's see. This is supposed to be motivational, so it could be like inspirational story or something. Um, hmm, let's see. What's a good title? Maybe for him personally, because he lives in this really, really dump of an apartment. He could call it... <laughs> um, let's see. Leaving the rat in the wall behind. Because eventually he's going to do that. Inspirational tale of a man who escapes his murderous apartment. <laughs> it hasn't happened yet, but it will, okay? So he's, he's like, pre-writing it, okay? Like, he knows he is going to be getting out of here soon. Um... And when he does, or when I do decide which apartment I want to move them into, oh, hey, Anita, just invite yourself in, why don't you? Okay, when I do decide which apartment I want them to move into, I'm going to renovate it. I'll probably do a speed build, just so that you guys get to see the process. Um, I feel like I want to do more speed builds. They're kind of fun, and I'm not very good at building, so it's really good practice for me. So yes, look forward to that. That will be coming at some point. I'm still not sure if I want them to move into the spice market or the fashion district. Either one works. I would keep them in the art district. It's just that the apartments around here just aren't very good. Like, there's this one. This is probably the most affordable apartment complex, right? But I already moved some Sims into this unit right here, and Anita lives over here, and it's just, like, nothing that I want them to live in. So, yeah. The other building is way too expensive. Like, the apartments are gorgeous there. But we couldn't afford them. We'd have to like sell our organs or something, so it's not gonna work. Um, <laughs> he's hungry. What, how long have I been recording? Oh, geez, okay. Yeah, I probably need to end this part here. <laughs> um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, feel free to leave a like, comment, and or subscribe. Um, once again, I just really appreciate your support. It means the world to me. And I will see you guys in the next part. Bye!